He's only just 17, like Izzy Brown, who's ahead of him. Boga might not need him. Off he goes, drifting run. 1-2 with Izzy Brown. Boga's got there. Solanke's in the middle. So's Kiwomia. Oh, Izzy Brown. Well, it was a good bad one, as Tommy Langley would say, that cross. Was he a, certainly didn't mean that. Yeah, it was a good bad one. But uh, do you know the good thing about it, Ben? Initially, I mean, Jeremy's fantastic on the ball. He's got himself into a great position. Good one, too. The chance, so for Armstrong is through. The Beanie's out quickly. Well yeah. done, him. Brilliant, the two Beanie. Brilliant. On his toes. Good starting position. And that's why he's able to come out and just uh, smother the ball. Good save. He would get on the end of it. Yeah, what are you saying to him? He's, on that situation, just a little bit too narrow. If he comes wider, he gets the ball into his feet. But because of his starting tip position, the ball had to be threaded between defenders, and that's why it had to be absolutely spot on. High line from Chelsea, and there was a bit of space at the start of this Newcastle attack, and there might still be here. And it'll be wide. Really knew where that was all the way. Don't worry about that. It was uh, Liam Smith with the shot. High up the park, and as I always say, with fullbacks, got a little bit of a nosebleed. You want me to get it back? Here is Seren Cambo back in the right back position. It's Charlie Colkett. Who, uh, in 15 minutes so far hasn't quite shown us his wonderful range of passing, but I'm sure he will over the course of this game. The old uh, over the can of beans. I think certainly uh, applies to that left boot of his. Here's Seren Cambo again. Colkett with the strength to win it over Olivier Kement. Oh, and what a pass for Izzy Brown. Oh, good save from Woodman. What a save. That's a brilliant save by Woodman, but the pass, Ben. Out wide. Christensen well placed to deal with the uh, first cross. Second time round as well, and Izzy Brown helping out. And then again, Brown. Well done. Superb. Work great from him. Solanke just held his run, then he went, and he's onside. Dom Solanke, this is who Chelsea want to have the ball, and that is why. Dom Solanke 1 0. Strong, powerful, sure? deadly. Absolutely brilliant, Ben. I mean, Izzy Brown has been outstanding in this run. I mean, absolutely brilliant. He's gone through challenges, he's gone past players, he's used his pace, and the weight of the pass for Dom Solanke was absolutely spot on. Gives a big sense of forward, absolutely no decision to make. First touch was terrific, second touch sets it up, and there's the finish. Keeps a nice cool head and slots the ball with pace past Woodman. Great goal. So much to a could put us under pressure, but defensively, once you let a goal in, you tend to drop off a little bit. So that'll open the game right out. It's the best thing we could have had. Obviously, the goal's important, but for the game, it might give us a chance to go on and get a couple more. Well, Brown missed it. And Loftus Cheek. Oh, he's hit the post. Did that cross the line? The well, play goes on. It's a circus scramble in the Newcastle box. Goodness me. That's a good chance, really. Should be two. Should be two, Ben. Without a doubt. We should have done better there. Saying that. Just thought it was never gonna never gonna happen. Never gonna go in. Jeremy Boga fighting for the ball here. Fabulous fighting well. as well. And look at then the drift. Then he was taken out. Now is he drunk? Wonderful desire. And eventually, fair play to James Adcock. Yeah. Chance then for Newcastle from the free kick. And this is where we always say that is there something a little bit different? Or have they got someone special on the ball that we're unaware of? Greg Ollie is going to take it. They've got five up. Should be Beanies, but it's not. There was a little nick on it just in front of him. What you're saying, it's handball, Ben. Well, it looked like it might have been first off. We'll have a look in a second. Certainly seemed to lead with an arm. It wasn't quite Maradona, but Olivier Kemen has made it 1 1 here. Well, Mitchell Beanies convinced it's handball. It's again, it's one you have to see again. And if it is handball, let's have another look. Oh, easily, Ben, easily. Should be seen at the referee. That is a disgrace. It's worse than Maradona. Well, he's nowhere near it with his head, and he's got the cheek to claim him in as well. Might go to two hours plus pens. Here's Aaron's. 
Stay on your feet is the call from uh, Chelsea's coach. It's tricky, isn't he, Aaron? So we're going to have to keep an eye on him. Oli goes for goal. It was on target. So it wasn't going to sneak under Mitchell Beanie from there. No. Hulk, it turns to try and find the space. Oh, Ruben Loftus Cheek has gifted it to Armstrong. Great chance for 2 1, and it is. Oh dear. It's an absolute gift. And now he's scored in every round. And Newcastle, who were trailing, now lead. That's an absolute disaster, isn't it? What Ruben was thinking of here. Just comes off his heel, it's a poor pass. And it just gives him absolutely every opportunity, Adam Armstrong, to pick his spot. He does it sweetly. Probably the worst player that Ruben could have given it to. And he's buried it quite comfortably, but... Well, it's gone from bad to worse now, hasn't it? And we've got a lot of recovery to do. We've still got the quality, still got the ability. But that little bit of confidence will be ebbing away. Time and maybe go in at 2 2, and that'll lift everybody in the half time break. Yes, the first time they've been behind at all, of course, in this cup run. They've got character as well as talent, though. I'm sure. Don't want to do is concede another before the break because that really would be a second up. And Beanie is uh, forced to push that one over. Well, to be honest, Ben, I thought he could have caught this one, Mitchell Beanie. Just Andy Boash might have to calm one or two down in the break, Clyde, because what he can't have is one of them just, you know, going siding in out of utterly understandable fury. Beanie is uh, tested by that again, like the like the earlier curler he. Saw that one coming and knew it was going wide, knew where his post was. So what will give our lads a huge lift to win this game. Wouldn't it just? I feel like Loftus cheek the captain, but not just because he's the captain, but because of the position he plays. He's very important in there and he is a physical presence, but he does remind you of Mikel a bit in that you feel he could use that physique more than he does. This is Aina up from the back, little deflection on the cross and it's cleared. Charlie Colkett. So she need that wonderful left foot to get weaving its magic again. Solanke's come deep to collect this. And that's a lovely ball. Alex Kiwomia. Great chance. Yes. 2-2. Two -two. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. What a wonderful finish that is by Alex. But the pass was spot on yet again, Ben. Solanke comes deep. He's got nothing else on. He's got to play the pass and he plays it well. Maybe a slight deflection takes it into the path of Alex, but first touch was good. Finish absolutely terrific. It's a tough one that it he is. meant it, absolutely meant it, because the ball was slightly behind him and he slid it in about the only place he could put it from there. Yeah, and he's under pressure as well. He's being challenged. Loftus cheek. Boga. Shimmied away from one challenge. Good hit! Fantastic goal! Jeremy Boga take a bow. He scored one at the other end here for the under-21s. That was a beauty. That one was even better. Chelsea lead. Well, when you want something special, you need someone to step up and make a drive like this. He's done ever so well to take the ball away from the two midfield players. And when he gets into space, man, I thought the opportunity was there to go on from where he was. But I'll tell you what, he's buried this one sweetly in the bottom corner. Absolutely no chance for Woodman. And what a goal, Ben. We've seen a couple of wonderful goals from Chelsea. We might see one or two more yellow cards before this game's over. What a ball. It's a lovely pass. And you know, Kiwami is quick enough to get there. Early one into Solanke. He is on. Oh, Dom Solanke. I think the jumping defender has put him off because it was there. What a chance. Oh, that's a foul. I'll tell you what, it's a great ball out, out wide to Alex Kawamia. And In comes the Newcastle corner. There's Izzy Brown. Oh, that's defended at the near post, isn't it? What a ball forward. Chance to have a break here. Man of the match for me tonight, Izzy Brown. Here's uh, Kiwamia through for Solanke. He might have to do it on his own, but that doesn't generally pose problems for him. Charlie Colkett, it's on his right boot, and you wish it was on his left. Yeah, first touch for Solanke, just takes it back inside, Ben. If he gets this out of his feet, he does. about his game. He's one of those players who 
just needs to be tempered in the right direction. Certainly has got a lot of ability, and as we've already seen, bundles of pace. So Here goes Boga. So is this fella. Just drifting past them again like they're not there. Solanke trying to get in. That's a really tough challenge from Steri coming across. It had to be perfectly timed, and it was. It's a, it's a good tackle. I don't think Solanke thought he was going to get this ball. I think Jeremy's outfoxed even his own teammate here. It's a super little ball between the two defenders. Solanke a little, little bit flat-footed, but good challenge by the fullback who gets across well. Look at that. Boga is a joy to watch when he does things like that. He really is. Chelsea corner. While it's down here, Newcastle won't be equalising. Solanke with the chance. header. It's a chance, Ben, isn't it? I mean, it's a good ball in. Solanke gets across off the first defender. Ivash at the moment to make a second Chelsea change there. Sterry, good play from him to get back and win that. Here is Kemen. And Christensen got a bit on the ball, but it still fell the way of Greg Ollie here. And now Kemen again. That's a good pass, and it's a chance, and it's a strong hand from Mitchell Beeney to deny the substitute, Jonathan Quinn. Well, the only thing I would say is that he's hit the target here, Quinn, but I would expect Mitchell to make this save, to be honest. It's more or less straight at him. Kemen's header, straight at Beeney. That certainly was straight at him. Oh. <laughs> That's plenty of time. That was, it seemed like an, an eternity, though, for... Chelsea players, unless we can sneak another one, it'd be a game over. Here's Kiwomia. Well, there's a ball on here to Boga if Reese Mitchell can spot him. And he has. Boga, can he finish it? Reese Mitchell might. Oh, that's a really good block. Chelsea still have the ball, that's the main thing. Ruben Loftus cheek skipping away from the challenge from guess who? Here he is again. This has been impressive possession football. Chelsea have had the ball for a, a good minute and a half here. Yeah, just winding the clock down. Superb play. He's won the ball back, Jeremy Boga. Super play from Mitchell. And Boga's in the middle, and Kiwami's there. Boga! Oh! What a chance to finish the game off. Rich Mitchell does really, really well here. Just to hang on to the ball. Big part. It's an incredible, incredible record. Might be about to have another notch, but only if Chelsea can see out this particular danger, and it's looking dangerous. There's a shot from Kevin, and it's blocked. Newcastle wants something, a penalty, a corner, no, anything, come off their own man. they're not going to get it. It's come off their own man. I, I, just, I just don't get why Isaac Simon Cambo doesn't head this first ball. He's allowed it to bounce, which has put us really under pressure. And there we see the shot coming in, gets deflected away. Off the Newcastle player, substitute. Uh, uh, Herdman, I think. Yes, it was. The final shot of the game coming from Olivia Kemen, it looks like. And there's the final whistle. It is, is another Elliot. Youth Cup semi final for Chelsea. You can see what it means to them. Jeremy Boga, the match winner, and what a goal it was to win the match as well. Olivia Kemen's handball goal consigned to history as a footnote in this game, thankfully, as opposed to a deciding factor. Credit to Kiwamia as well for a really well taken goal and to Solanke who started it all off. Tears at full time. The joy for Chelsea. A real cup cracker here. Goals, gaffs, and controversy. But at the, at the end of it all, Chelsea have let their feet do the talking at St James's Park and they will face Arsenal in the semi final. 3 2 winners on Tyneside. What a game.